A few things to help you when you are looking at anything, a building or a still life, and you're trying to place things and find measurements and all sorts of things. Here's a simple, a simple way of looking at it. This was from um, another still life painting, but what we had here was a pair. There was another pair there that was on its side, so that's the, the piece at the bottom of the core. Now, a simple way of looking at things is to say, OK, right, this is the pair, the height of the pair, including the stalk. Now, if you were to take the stalk as a measurement, you could then go one, two, three, four, five. So you're breaking it down and you're working out a measurement. And once you've got one measurement, you can use it a long ways as well. It's a representation. When you're looking at things, also look at how things connect and overlap, such as that pair goes behind that one and there's something else behind. And look at that shape that it's given you. Okay, it's like a Y. It's like a circle divided into three parts. You also have to help you the negative space. So look at that shape that you are left with and look at that shape that you are left with. So just a few very simple rules to help you placing subjects checking how far apart they are and checking your angles just to make it a little bit easier. I hope that helps.